Hello world, Deborah here. Welcome back to Deborah Does Diamonds. Today we have another unboxing for you and it's from GBFKE and the best part is it's all Christmas goodies. So come join me. All right, let's get started. GBFKE, I had to write it down because I can never remember the order of the letters. Um, okay, let's see here. I remember most of the things that are in this package, but not all of them, so we'll discover the items together. How's that sound? See what we got. There we go. Okay, G B F K E. Let's just take everything out all at once. How about that? Ooh. Ooh. Man, there's all kinds of goodies in here. Look at all this. Wow. Might be a little longer video than I thought it was going to be. We've got a lot of stuff to go over. Okay. I think that's everything. My goodness. Okay. Let's see. Oh, uh, I'm going to do the Christmas cards first. I just thought this was such a great idea. And it's going to help you figure out how to put diamonds on your own Christmas cards, not ones that have actual symbols all over it. You can pick one of your Christmas cards out and decorate it and send it out without having to buy one from GBFKE. All right, let's take a look at those. I'm going to set these over here. Okay, let's see what we got. Um... You know me in these bags. We don't get along very good. I can, <laughs> I can never open them. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we have in here. All right. So the Christmas card came a little, little messed up. I've got a little bit of a crease here, so I don't know that that's something I would actually want to give to somebody for Christmas. So I don't know what to think of that. Hmm. But the picture's adorable. We got a little kitten, a little teddy bear there. Show the main camera. Alrighty. Let's see what we got for uh, glue here. Aw. Oh, it's such a shame that it's messed up in the corner there. It's so cute. The kitty has his little red sweater on for Christmas. The teddy bear. This beautiful little hat with Holly. Aw. All right, let's, oh, and they even sent you an envelope, which is also wrinkly. <laughs> Don't know if you're going to want to use that either. Okay. Well, at least you know what it comes with. That's good. Um, and here is our drill kit. Just the standard tray, wax, single placer pen. Okay. And, oh, you know what? I wanted to see if. Oh, well that's, oh, look at that. What a cute card. It says, Dear Santa, love, and you put your name in there. So you can write Santa what you'd like for Christmas. Oh, that is adorable. <laughs> uh, all right, let's see what we have for drills for this one. There we go. got here. So we've got some reds, a couple little oranges there, probably for the uh, collar on the cat sweater. Oh, we have an AB here. So AB is Aurora Borealis. I like to say absolutely beautiful. That's what AB stands for. <laughs> 
and then a few more browns, tans. Oh, that's pretty. Great. So there are those. Okay, one more thing about this card. So it's definitely sticky enough. You don't have to worry about that. It comes with a little cover sheet, like usual diamond paintings. Um, but the diamond painting appears to be on the back of the card. <laughs> so here it says, we wish you a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas on the inside. And then a place to write to Santa. But then the drills are on the back. So that's how the card comes. Okay. We'll put a link in the description for that one. Let's move on and see what else we've got here. Okay, next item. So we have some Christmas ornaments, and it looks yeah. like, and oh, it looks like these have different uh, pictures on them. So let's open up this second order of ornaments. Okay. Now this cord is in much better shape. All of it is usable, except for this very small part at the end here. So that looks good. All right. There we go. Let's see what we have here. Okay, I'm going to check the glue on this one here. Oh yeah, glue's good. Um, these are all red and white, it looks like. And um, so we have an ornament, oh, I'll hold them up to the camera here. We have an ornament, Christmas tree, that one's really cute. Snowflake. That's going to be real pretty when it's done. Aw, little angel. How cute. <laughs> a bell with another snowflake. A heart. Oh, little gingerbread man. He's adorable. What else have we got here? Oh, little gingerbread house to go with your gingerbread man. <laughs> a star. And another snowflake. Very pretty. All right. Let's see what we have for drills. I do see some AB. Don't forget, that means absolutely beautiful, not just Aurora Borealis. So, <laughs> all right. So we have got two packages of Aurora Borealis that are the same color, white. And then we have some beautiful reds and some of these special shapes that have um, like the peacock type coloring to it. All right, there we go. And the same kind of uh, drill kit. We have some extra baggies in this one, single placer. Very cute. All right. I say everything's cute. I noticed that on my unboxing the other day from Fan Cells. Every picture that I opened up, I'm like, that is so cute. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> I think everything's cute. <laughs> I'll try not to do that so much. All right. Set that up to the side there. Okay, let's move on to the next thing, shall we? Okay, moving on. So, um, what did I want? Oh, I wanted to explain my table. So, I still have some fall stuff down here because I just bought them and I thought they were pretty and I didn't want to wait till next year. And then I found this beautiful little bow. It's actually like to go on a present. It has adhesive on the back, but I just thought it was cute. So that's my transition into Christmas. <laughs> so we just have three more items. This one here, I think is a Christmas stocking project. Let's see what we've got.
Oh, and I have a new trash tray I have to show you later, too. Don't let me forget that. All right. Okay. So already I can tell this is a softer canvas. Feels a little more like linen. And now you know why. So, look at this beauty. You put your diamonds on. Cut along the edge of the pattern, it says. And then blue color is the embroidery trace is what it says all right so there's little blue line little blue dots let's see oh all righty cut along the edge of the pattern blue color is the embroidery okay so let's see what we've got here oh that's why it's embroidery. There's the needle and the thread. Okay, what this is, is you're actually making a complete stocking, believe it or not, <laughs> with diamonds and a little bit of stitching going on. So um, once you're done laying your diamonds down, isn't that cute? It says Merry Christmas. Fluffy, fluffy at the top. Um, Put your diamonds on, cut it out, and then there's a little pattern of blue dots all along the edging where you would then take your thread and needle and stitch it together. So that's really cute. I'm going to have to figure this whole thing out, and then I can explain it better after I've done it. All right, so here we have the colors. We have a red, of course, and white. There is an AB. Very pretty. And then we have a little bit of yellow, purple, green, and brown. All right. So that's for your Santa there. And then you have these two bags of um, red crystal special uh, drills. Let me show those to you. One's a little larger than some of these smaller ones here. And then your standard kit here, single placer. So you do get a needle and the thread there as well. Okay, so that is the Christmas stocking. Okay, so I will let you know on the stockings here. They look like they're in pretty good shape. And again, it's when you open it, it's more of a... Um, like a cloth as opposed to a plasticky canvas. So that'll be really fun to do. Okay. On to the next thing. Let's see what we've got here. All right. I think this is another um, stocking. So let's see what we've got. There we go. And when we're done here, I just have a couple quick tip or two for you for your diamond tray, diamond setup. All right, this one has a little more of a crease in it there. Yep. Oh, isn't that sweet? <laughs> uh, another stocking. This one has a little snowman carrying his Christmas tree home. That's really cute. I said it always say cute it's adorable we'll go with that okay and you have your um, needle and thread in your standard kit and let's look at our diamonds see if we have any specials here it looks like they have three specials going down um, the front of the snowman maybe that's um, supposed to be coal let's see what we have here. Oh, yep, I see black buttons. That's going to be the coal for their for the little snowmen. Isn't that cute? <laughs> All right, we have some pretty red ones here. And ooh, I love these. These are AB. Absolutely beautiful Aurora Borealis in yellow. See if I can get that to focus. Oh, there we go. Yeah, those are really cute. 
that's different. I've never seen um, I've never seen um, diamonds that color and shape. That's nice. Okay. Oh, found another special. Some little bit of blue. Alrighty, and then our regular diamonds. Just an array of colors for the Christmas tree and the ornaments and a scarf. Alrighty, there we go. This one you can, on this pattern you can see the blue dots that are around um, the edge of the stockings. I don't know. There you go. You can pick those up right here. Yep. So it shows you how to sew them together. I'm not very good at sewing. We'll see how it turns out. <laughs> and our last item for GBFKE. Oh, I've been waiting a long time to see this painting. I cannot wait. Okay, so this painting I did see on another channel. I hope it's okay if I give a shout out. I'm going to give a shout out to Natalia from Lovecraft Forever. I saw her open this diamond painting and I had to have it. I love it. Okay, so it's old school again. Old school picture and it just warmed my heart. I thought, oh my gosh, I have to get that for Christmas. Okay, let's see. And it's a square. I do remember that. Oh, look at this. Oh, what a cute... Look at this skirt. Is that not the cutest? Oh, I love this picture. Reminds me of like a... Maybe a scene you would see um, in the 1950s, maybe. Something like that. We've got some um, little red birds up sitting in the tree here. All right, so it says that it's 40 by 40. Oh, and her hat's so cute, too. Look at all the fur trim. Oh, very nice. I'm not able to straighten this out too quickly for you here. Um, we want to check the symbols on it. Let's see. And even in the darker spaces, like where um, the green is showing here at the bottom, um, very clear, very easy to see. So I'm going to um, show that to you up close. All right. Let's take a closer look at the symbols here. Very clear. And the glue is so good, it almost shines. You can kind of see how glossy the glue is right, right here. Yep. Very nice. Look how clear those are, even in the darker areas. Very nice. All right. So, beautiful. 21 colors in this particular picture. Oh, I just love this little girl. Just so beautiful. Mm, 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 mm. You know what her dress reminds me of? <laughs> um, in fact, it's the tree skirt that we use in our house. It's the real fuzzy red with the white around the edge. That's what that kind of reminds me of a little bit. So, yeah, very cute. Okay, let's look at the drill kit here. Just your standard kit with that. And the diamonds on our last painting. Okay. Oh, beautiful colors. Look at that dark green. Mm, 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 mm. Love it. All right, we'll just run through these for you. That green is so pretty. Dark evergreen. Beautiful red, of course. I can't wait to see how these uh, little birds turn out up in the corner as well. 
Um, I'm curious. Okay, and a few more. There we go. Alrighty, so that is the picture of this beautiful little girl in her Christmas outfit. I will definitely get that done and show you the finished product. So, all right, very good. All right, so I have one or two more items that I'd like to share with you, and um, let me get those set up. Okay, so we're back. <laughs> so, for a review of GBFKE on my first unboxing from them, many of the items looked really good, especially the um, larger painting of the little girl but I will have to say that um, some of the items just they just didn't travel well <laughs> um, the packaging did not protect the card here with the um, big crease down the front you see that right there um, so that that was one negative uh, what was the other thing oh the gold braid not being able to use a good portion of that um, was a little disappointing, so I'll have to go find something else to use in its place, but just wanted to let you know. And then, um, but I loved the, uh, I absolutely loved these um, ornaments. I thought that was a hit. These are really, really cute great project for kids or to do you know just with the whole family so that was a winner I love the idea of the um, of the stockings I'll let you know how that turns out I'll put one together um, if you like any of the items let me know if you're if you don't care for the item let me know and wh why if you'd like me to review something different let me know okay but that's our GBFKE Christmas couple little tips for you today I have a new trash tray. Isn't it gorgeous? Beautiful, beautiful crown. This is actually a votive candle holder. <laughs> Found this one at um, Hobby Lobby. They have those on sale right now. So check that out. Let me show you the camera up here. Look at how pretty that is. I liked it so much I got three. So I have two for candles and one to use as a trash tray and the other um, quick tip is instead of using the tweezers that you get that you sometimes get in your um, kit here I like to use just like an eyebrow tweezer so head to Target get an eyebrow tweezer it works perfectly some of them are um, pointy like this and you can also find some that are, have a flatter edge that will allow you to pick things up so when you're picking up diamonds, stray diamonds, hairs, you know, whatever, off of the glue. So those are my tips for today. All right, and with that, we're going to do our outro. So that was our Christmas unboxing from GBFKE. Thank you for joining us today. I will have links in the description to all the items that we reviewed. And uh, let me know in the comments which item that you liked the best. All right. And don't forget, folks, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up if you love the video today. And don't forget to hit the bell notification so you'll know when my next video is on its way. All right? So we'll see you next time. But in the meantime, be good to one another. Bye-bye. All right, this is going to be the keeper. Think, 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 think. think. Okay. Three, two... One. Now with the puppy, puppy, puppy. I can't function without my dog. I'm getting better. I look pretty tired by the end. That was a good one. Turn this off now.